The impeachment process begins with the House Judiciary Committee reviewing charges against an official and determining if there are grounds for impeachment. The full House of Representatives votes on one or more articles of impeachment, and if at least one gets a simple majority vote, the official is indicted and considered impeached. From there, the proceedings move to the Senate for a trial presided over by the Supreme Court Chief Justice, with the Senate acting as jury. In order to get a conviction, a supermajority, or two-thirds of the senators, must find the official guilty. Once convicted, he is immediately removed from office. The Democrats will need to win 218 seats during the midterm elections to regain control over the House and initiate impeachment proceedings. Polls indicate that they have a good chance of doing so. However, the Democrats are much less likely to win enough seats in the Senate to ensure a two-thirds majority vote for conviction.